and welcome back to Access Daily from Universal Orlando Resort. That was Lexi Underwood right there, who starred as Carrie Washington's daughter in a show we all love to talk about. Little fires everywhere. Well, Lexi is now taking on the role of Malia Obama Hello. in Showtime's new anthology series, <laughs> The First Lady. Nice to meet you, Lexi. So nice to meet you all. How you doing? I feel great. I feel super grateful to be here. We're laughing because we come in with you with Kerry Washington. Now yeah. you're with Viola Davis. You only work yeah. with, with the best. The quality of quality. Is that by design? I just feel fortunate and grateful that it's all coming together this way. Kerry Washington and Miss Viola Davis, they were both two actresses that inspired me to get started in this industry. And yeah. they were also two actresses that I vividly remember. I actually have a journal that I wrote down about oh. three years prior to me booking Little Fires Everywhere. And I wrote down Kerry Washington and I wrote down every all her projects that she did and the history of just her and her career and same with Viola and then three to four years later here we are. Well, what so else is in that yeah. journal? What, what else yeah. is in there? No, for me, it was just, I was doing a lot of um, just research when it comes to the history of black women in the industry and just the perseverance and the strength that it took for them to get to the, where they are now. And they were really inspirations for me to be where I am right now and hopefully to wherever I go next. Look, watch her hit her stride exactly. right here. And is it true, did you go to camp with the Obama's daughters? Yeah, so I'm originally from DC and um, they went to Sidwell and I went to the Sidwell camp as well. I'm way younger than them. So we weren't in the same classrooms, but right, we right. were at the same camp. So then you show up to set and you're working with Viola Davis. Yeah. What is that first day like? Because I would imagine you're like grabbing her hand and you're like, uh, Miss Davis. It's right. her voice, right? her talent, right? her voice, her cadence. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie, I was definitely like a little stunned when I first walked onto of the set. Of course. But she is the most down to earth, just wonderful human being. Mm -hmm. And I feel like I learned so much from her during that process. What does this series <laughs> highlight? Like, what does it take us through? First Lady, it gives you an intimate look into the life of what it is to be a First Lady and what it is, what it means to live in the White House. Um, you really get to see just everything that they go through and how it truly affects them without, you know, having to present, you know, to the rest of the world like you're okay 24-7. And honestly, after doing uh, First Lady, I feel like I gained a lot of respect. Obviously, I had so much respect for the First Family in, in general, but period. But even more. But even more after, especially a lot more um, respect. It resonated with me when, when they go low, we go high. And just understanding the power of what that means to be able to say that in the midst of negativity, you know. And some of the worst things being exactly. said Exactly. To be able to still want to give back and be kind and persevere through that, it's something that really blows my mind of the fact that she was able to do that. And I truly feel like everyone, uh, we are obviously, everybody's inspired by Michelle Obama, right. but after this, she'll be- It's a whole nother level. Oh, have you heard from level. Malia? I have not, no, I, di I didn't get to talk to the Obama family, but fingers crossed, I'm really hoping that oh, after you the are. Show, something tells me that like, after oh. they see your performance, they're gonna be reaching out to you. Yeah, <laughs> what was the key to getting Malia right? Um, it was definitely hard because there's not a lot of stuff out yeah, there regarding them, private. but I respect that a lot because the girls got to have a normal childhood. Yeah. Um, so for me, I was just on YouTube like almost every night just trying to do deep dives. Literally, if it was just them in the background of a video, just trying to pull as much information as possible. I think I watched Becoming about like over 20 times, yeah. mm -hmm. read A Promised Land and Becoming quite frequently before stepping on set, but transforming into Malia was something that, it was an experience that I will never forget, and I feel so honored and fortunate that I was able to bring her story to life because it's a story that we haven't heard of. You are part of this kind of history, yeah. you know what I mean, in a really, really cool way. Speaking of really, really cool, we're in Orlando. Yes. Right. I'm dying to know when you, is this your first time in Orlando? Yes, this is my first time. Oh, girl, you got to ride everything. Okay. Right, no, I'm about to go so much for you to do. Right, so but... now you're also working on this really cool project, Sneakerella? Yeah. Yeah. Cinderella is so dope. It is, you know, a reimagining, a retelling of Cinderella. So instead of the glass shoe, we have a sneaker. Come on. And instead of uh, Cinderella being a female, it is played by Chosen Jacobs, who's a male. So we have the gender role reversal as well. So nice. instead of me playing Cinderella, I play Prince Charming. Come oh, on. I like this. What you know right. about that? Yes. <laughs> oh, Lord. Batman is next. I love Hi. it. Now, Lexi, I hear you are working on a project in particular maybe bringing Aaliyah's story oh. yeah. to the screen. Yeah, Aaliyah's one of my favorite singers. Growing up, she is actually the reason why I started like singing and getting into music. So for me, it would be such a dream role for me. Have you talked to Drake? Because you know, he has a lot of her music, yes, the, the he unreleased stuff. Yes. We're gonna make this yes. happen. Yes, please. Would please love to see it. it. Lexi, I love all your hard work. Guys, 18 years old and look at everything she's accomplishing. <laughs> Thank you. The Thank First you. Lady premieres April 17th on Showtime. We will be watching. Great job, Lexi. Thank so you. good to see you.